I have so many baby hauls. I promise you guys this is going to be my last one. It has been a wild last month. I've been waiting for certain gifts from certain family members. Most of them have not come in just due to the fact that I haven't seen my family members. They haven't shipped them out yet. And one of my gifts actually was stolen by somebody who lives in my apartment complex. I am currently now 38 weeks and about five days. I could literally go into labor at any moment now and I was just like, you know what, let me get all this content out, but I'm trying to get as much content out before my daughter arrives. I do have a video on the stolen package, so if you want to go and watch that video, I will leave the link in the description box below. Today's gonna be more of like a clothing haul because majority of the stuff that I have in this video is clothing. I got a different kind of setup here. I have the last of the gifts around me right now, so we're gonna go through those. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and yeah, let's just let's just get right on it. Like I mentioned in the intro, there is a couple gifts that I'm waiting to receive from a couple family members. Um, you know, COVID, we have new restrictions where I'm at right now, so you know, seeing people, it's not really it's not really the vibe, so I can understand on that part. There is a quilt that is supposed to be coming for my baby. It does match the crib set. And I think there's a couple other things, but the family members don't really want to, you know, go out and be around other people just due to COVID. So that's the last of the gifts that I'm waiting for. But other than that, I think that I, I think that I got all the gifts that I, mm, and one was stolen. So there is three gifts that I'm waiting for, but I probably won't put them in a video. The gifts that I got today are from my aunt and her mom. That would be my great aunt, I think. They are right here behind me. Let's just start off with the big one, okay? I already opened these when I was at my mom's because that's where the gifts were dropped off. So my aunt did put some cards. Um, I'm not gonna read them out, but they are very adorable. Sorry if you can't see the cards, the lighting is a little bit weird. Um, in some of my previous videos, I did try to fix the light and I just don't wanna keep going back and forth with the lighting in this video because the camera is at a different angle, so that was a card. In the first bag, and I'm just gonna put the bag in front of me. Sorry, you guys can't see. Let me show my bump first of all. So yeah, this is 38 weeks and I wanna say five days. So like I said, a majority of this is clothing, which I love. We've got some socks. Oh, this is not gonna be good. <laughs> Let's see if I can fix this. The sizing for these is newborn. Okay, I said I wasn't gonna play with the light, but this is the only change in the lighting that I'm gonna do. Okay, more socks. Newborn again. These are so cute. Like. Some hats. And I love the quality of these hats. These are very like warm and thick. Two things of mitts here. Size newborn. Next, we have two sleepers, two pink sleepers here. This one says, hello, cute, kind, just a bunch of little words. I guess I can show the card off since the lighting is different. This is the card that my aunt gave. Then this is a converter gown. So I'm assuming that the buttons come out here and you can button them up here at the bottom. It comes with socks and a hat. If I didn't already have a coming home outfit, I probably would bring this one to the hospital with me, but I like the outfit that I picked for her coming home. I think these are called sleep sacks. It's polka dotted and long. This is in a size zero to three months. My aunt also got a book. Five years of memories. It just has a bunch of things that you fill out here. So full name, the day that she arrived, first tooth, 
stuff like that. The second gift here, we have here, newborn size. It says happy little loved and it comes with, is this cheetah print? Cheetah print pants. Super cute. And the hood has some little ears on it. Oh, if you watched my video on the gift box that was stolen, that was sent from my aunt, my aunt has sent me about five to six sleepers from Ottawa. So I hadn't bought any sleepers for my daughter myself because my aunt was sending me six sleepers. So I was like, you know what, six plus the three that I have here, I should be okay. If you watch that video, you will you'll know what happened. But um, the aunt that went and purchased all of these gifts, she replaced all the sleepers that I lost. Thank God. So we're gonna go through those sleepers. Plaid, which my sister is really happy about because my sister, I guess, she has some plaid shirt that she wants to match with my daughter. So this was really cute. These are all newborn as well. favorite it's hilarious I'm doing this in this room because this is where that crazy ladybug is or usually is a ladybug sleeper a cute ladybug sleeper baby clothes shopping is like an addiction let me tell you you know you go into the store thinking I'm not gonna get a lot like I'm only gonna get this that and that you walk into the baby clothes store and it is just over it's over for you this next one, um, it's not baby clothes. It is something that my aunt told me that she wanted to get off my gift registry. So, is it okay? She bought me a baby monitor. I think this is the baby monitor. Yeah, the baby monitor. <laughs> and she put these little things on the gift bags. They're so cute. It's like a bubbly little thing. I don't know how to explain it. I just thought the decorations were so cute. We got some slippers here, or no, these are socks with a little headband. This is adorable. This is a sweater, I believe, or like a cardigan, newborn. This was from the sale rack, apparently, judging off the price tag. I feel like people judge you when you look at the sales rack, but you can find some cute ass shit on the sales rack. Don't ever feel like, don't ever feel any kind of way because you're shopping and looking through the sales racks because that's where all the good shit is. We have this three piece right here, a sweater with the matching pants. Is that pants? What the heck is that? Well, that's the hood. Oh, what size is this? Three months and the onesie on the back, just so adorable. Last but not least, we have the last gift from my aunt. And this is the mobile. Um, I'm not taking this mobile out of the box, but it is a cute, I think it's handmade. And I feel like this is off Amazon, but it is a mobile. So the next gift that I wanna go through with you guys, let's go through my sisters because that is the gift that I was just, I already opened it, but I was anticipating it so much. And I ended up loving everything that my sister got for my baby. Like, I already ripped this stuff out, so I don't know why I'm trying to put it back. This is from my sister Tia. Me and Tia have, like, this weird psychic connection. I would go, because I had no idea what she was getting. I didn't think she was getting this much stuff for my daughter. 
So I would go out and I would be looking through baby clothes and I would send her pictures of stuff and when she was here with me opening this gift she was like thank god you didn't get this and you didn't get this and you didn't get this as I was taking the clothes out because half of the stuff that I was pulling out of this box or that I was pulling out of here was stuff that I had sent her from the store telling her oh my god I should get this oh my god I should get this like me and Tia have this weird connection Tia knows me so well Wonder Woman is like my favorite superhero six to nine months my first valentine's i don't know my daughter won't be six to nine months i just did the math in my head it's 18 months i'm proof daddy doesn't always play video games and you're right since we live in canada tia decided to get the baby some canada gear this is 18 to 24 months. This is like a onesie. I don't know what these are called. Uh, it has Canada on the butt. And I love that Tia got clothing for like further away so that it's not something that I have to worry about. You know what I'm saying? Everyone has been buying stuff for like the first year and I like how Tia went and got stuff for later. So after the first year. And my favorite thing to do in the world laugh i love this once again 12 to 18 months we got leggings and my favorite color to match a lavender sweater this is something that i'm just like she's gonna be looking crisp Hopefully I didn't just mess up the lighting. So the next gift, let's go with what my mom has purchased. It's just in a Walmart bag. Oh, okay, so there is some beauty sponges in here. Maybe I'll put this in a makeup video. Let me take that out. Some slippers. Let me see. Newborn. And it has a flower on the butt. My mom just goes out and buys things and it's, I'm telling you guys, once the baby clothes, like it's a wrap. You buy one, you're going back. This is kind of like boy. I don't know. I'm not questioning anything. I'm just, maybe she, maybe my daughter will wear it. If you think I'm cute, you should see my mom, period. My mom has a friend that she works with that actually went and gifted some socks for the baby. How many pairs are in here? There's five pairs of socks in here. My mom also got some Belly Breggs stickers. So this is for when we take pictures of her at milestones from one month to a year and then crawling, walking, I can roll over, I can stand. All that good stuff I'm pretty sure my mom also got this she got this three piece from Carter's sweet little one comes with the onesie there's nothing on the onesie beside besides the butterflies and then there is some pants here with a butterfly on the booty I'm getting hella confused because my mom will go out and just randomly buy stuff and then bring it over here and then I'm kind of like I sit down and I'm like, okay, is this from my mom or who the heck is this from? Tia also gifted this. Like I was telling you guys, Wonder Woman is my favorite. My sister was like, okay, I gotta get your daughter something. I gotta get my niece something. So she got her this Batman thing. I don't know if this is for boys, but I was just like, you know what? My daughter is gonna be wearing all colors. I'm not really a color freak. Like it's not gonna be all pinks and it has to be purple and it has to be yellow and it has to be a girl color. The clothing and other stuff like that, it doesn't have to be like obviously you want it to be girly because my daughter's not a boy, 
but at the end of the day my daughter's not gonna remember everything like you know what I'm saying it's not that big of a deal to me but this I wanted this one in this color we finally got her a winter suit even though it's like warm outside and it, it it's January like it's Christmas even though it's supposed to be snowing and hailing and all kinds of shit it is sunny so maybe my daughter won't even need this this year um, but it's zero to three months another friend of my mother's very long time friend of my mom's got this present back here I think this might have been for my mom as well but I'm not 100% sure was this for my mom too? Okay, I can't remember. I think my mom got this for my daughter. I love mommy, I love daddy socks. And then I am like 99.9% .9 sure this is also from my mom, but it could be from the friend. Zero to three months, another sleeper. Because I think my mom got this after my gift box was stolen and all my sleepers were in it. So yeah, I, I think this is from my mom. My mom was like, okay, hey, I'm gonna go pick you up a sleeper. Don't even worry about it. The gift from my mom's friend, that is these. She got a Reebok sweater. What size is this for? 18 months. Love it, love it. My friend Cynthia gifted this big activity play mat. In my last video, <laughs> in one of my other videos, I did show you guys the one that my baby father and my fiance to be and my husband to be <laughs> we did buy one but cynthia went and also got one which i'm not even mad about because this one can stay at our house and then this one can go to grandma's house and then grandma can have some toys and stuff at her house too the last thing that i'm going to show you guys i ordered this off one site i don't know which site this is okay so this is something that i went for last minute <laughs> Or did I send it? Either way, this came like last minute. I think they wait till like the end of your pregnancy to send this. I'm gonna open it now. I'm not 100% sure what is in this. This is actually what came the day after my gift box was stolen. So I was afraid that this would also get misdelivered, but it didn't. Oh, perfect. So we have some formula in here. Ooh. Thank God. Oh, okay. So this is what came in this. I'm also gonna leave in the description box the website that I went to apply for this if I haven't left it in the other baby haul videos. Either way, the link to get this package will be in my description box. We got Cetaphil lotion. I'm surprised that this came in here because I wasn't expecting to get this. Um, what is this? Liquid formula and more formula. I did get some formula from my mom as well. Okay, well I'm really um, impressed with this packaging. Or not the packaging, I'm impressed with the package. So that was my third and final baby haul slash clothing haul. Um, baby haul 2.0. If you guys like this video and enjoyed the baby content, make sure that you are liking the video, okay? Give it a thumbs up, give it a thumbs down, whatever you wanna do. Leave a comment, and if you wanted, you know, ring that notification bell so that you're notified when I post more videos. That is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.